Hi guys, it's Bags and President Ross. Today we have an updated election map according to realclearpolling.com. Who do you guys want to win? Let us know in the comments. Also, like, share, and subscribe for more videos. And let us know, have you already early voted? And if so, who did you vote for and why? Don't forget to subscribe. We're trying to get to 3,000 subscribers before Election Day. Let's film that beautiful map according to Real Clear Politics and RealClearPolling.com. As always, the blues are for Kamala Harris, Democrats, and Timothy Blow to Biden walls. They are Washington, Oregon, California, Hawaii, Colorado, New Mexico, Minnesota, parts of Nebraska, Illinois, Virginia, New York, Vermont, Connecticut, New Jersey, Massachusetts, Delaware, Rhode Island, Maryland, and the District of D.C., and parts of Maine are all blue for Kamala Harris and Timothy Walls, Blow to Biden. And as always, the reds are for Republicans, Donald J. Trump, J.D. Vance's Hillbilly Eulogy. They are Montana, Idaho, Wyoming, Utah, Alaska, North Dakota, South Dakota, most of Nebraska, Kansas, Oklahoma, Texas, Iowa, Missouri, Arkansas, Louisiana, Mississippi, Alabama, Florida, South Carolina, Tennessee, Kentucky, West Virginia, Indiana, Ohio, and parts of Maine, the second district of Maine to be exact. Now let's look at RealClearPolling.com's statistics for these seven battleground swing states they will determine the United States election. Currently, without them calculated in, we have Kamala Harris and bloated Biden walls are at 226 electoral votes to John J. Trump and J.D. Vance's hillbilly eulogies, 219 electoral votes. We are filling them in in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Nevada with 6 electoral votes. According to RealClearPolling.com, Trump is leading in Nevada by 1.5. Let's making Nevada red for Donald J. Trump. He takes a tight gap with 226 Kamala Harris to Donald J. Trump's 225 electoral votes. A one electoral vote difference. Arizona, according to RealClearPolling.com, Arizona has Trump in the lead with 2.3 in Arizona, making Arizona red. For Donald J. Trump and J.D. Vance. That makes Donald J. Trump gain the lead over Kamala Harris and Blow to Biden. Next up is Wisconsin. According to RealClearPolling.com, Wisconsin has Kamala Harris at 0.2 in the lead. She was at 0.3 for the last two days. Therefore, Wisconsin is blue for Kamala Harris and Timothy Walls. Michigan, according to RealClearPolling.com, Michigan is... At 0 0.8 for Kamala Harris. Oh, they must hate their gasoline-powered factories and love electric vehicle factory mandates. Making Michigan blue for Kamala Harris and bloated Biden. Georgia, with its 16 electoral votes, according to RealClearPolling.com, Trump has a 2.6 lead in Georgia thanks to his reaction to the hurricanes and Kamala's negligence to the hurricanes, making Georgia red for Donald J. Trump and J.D. Vance. North Carolina, according to RealClearPolling.com, Trump has a 1.5 lead in North Carolina. Make North Carolina red for Donald J. Trump thanks to his reaction to the hurricane and Kamala Harris's five-day <laughs> delay in reaction to the hurricane. Currently, that puts Kamala Harris at 251 electoral votes to Donald J. Trump's 268. The odds and tides have flipped from the beginning of this video. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, that like, and tell us how you feel right now before we fill in Pennsylvania. I'll give you a five-second head start to type in if you're happy or angry right now. Five, four, three, two, one. Hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and also type that comment, hit post. We have Pennsylvania, according to RealClearPolling.com. Pennsylvania, in its 19 electoral votes, has Trump in a 0.4 lead, making Pennsylvania red for Donald J. Trump, J.D. Vance, and the Hillbilly Eulogy. Making Trump and J.D. Vance your president and vice president of the United States of America, the big winner of the 2024 presidential election in the United States of America. I'm President Ross. And I'm Bags. And we are Out. not losers like Kamala.